Hey, what is going on ladies and gents? Peter here back at you again. Thank you for joining me. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can farm unlimited amounts of epic gear as well as XP. Now, uh, I hesitate in calling this a legendary farm because um, so far from this boss, I've only seen it drop uh, the legendary Hellfire SMG. I don't know if it dropped anything else and, you know, so I don't want to, you know, false advertisement. So, I'm just going to call it epic farming. All right? All right. Let's get into it. First things first, you're going to go ahead and load into the Voracious Canopy on Eden Prime. Uh, sorry, I mean uh, Eden 6. Alright, so this is going to be the only spawn point on the map here. And you're just going to follow the, my cursor here and head on over to the uh, Legendary Hunt. You know, for Mr. What's-His-Face? The mustache guy, Hammerlock. It's uh, right next to the Dead Drop. Uh, side note, you'll want to make a small detour and head on over to where I am on the map here because there's a new use station. So, um, you know, if you die or you, know, you need to restart for whatever reason, uh, this will be a good respawn point. Alright, so now for this trick to work, you're going to need something that will deal cryo damage. Now, this can come from your weapon, uh, abilities, or grenade. It does not matter. You'll just need something that will do uh, cryo damage. So, for my case, I'm going to be using this SMG that has cryo. Now, now, this trick is actually an easter egg to the movie Gremlins. And uh, for those that don't know, in the movie, when they get wet, they multiply. And the same applies here. Unfortunately, we don't have a uh, water elemental. So the next best thing is cryo, which actually works. So uh, you're going to go ahead and head on over to the boss spawn location. As I'm doing right now, I'm just going to go ahead and deal with these assholes first. And yes, this is the conference call. It is not as strong as the pre-nerfed uh, version from Borderlands 2, but it's still, uh, you know, pretty good. Alright, now that that's clear, let's go ahead and spawn the Mulkabakabakomakabatakan. Uh, all right, once he spawn, make sure you do not kill him. Uh, you'll want to do a crap ton of cryo damage, so he'll multiply, as you can see here. And from here, you can kill his clones as much as you want, and he'll drop, you know, a crap ton of loot, depending on your Mayhem level. Now, I am playing on Mayhem 2, I forgot to set it to Mayhem 3, but, you know, it still drops a decent amount of loot on Mayhem 2. And this is pretty much all there is to it, just keep on killing his clones for XP and loot. Uh, now, side note, if you want to farm XP with this method, you'll want to play in offline mode, because for whatever reason, you'll get more XP on offline mode. Uh, then online. So yeah, if you're doing this for XP, go ahead and play in offline mode. Alright, so right here, I skipped forward a little bit. This is after about three to four minutes of farming because I ran out of <laughs> ammo. Um, and as you can see, you know, this is a pretty decent amount of loot for Mayhem 2. And he seems to always drop, at least for me, uh, the Hellfire SMG. So uh, I'm gonna do this again on Mayhem 3 and let's see what we get. Thank <laughs> you. 
another Hellfire. So, uh, I don't know if you drop anything else, but if you want yourself a Hellfire, now you know where to get one. Giggity. Alright, so that's gonna be it for this video. Hopefully you guys find it useful. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button. And, uh, don't forget to like, sub, and obey?